Well, the mission of the uh, Frank Lita Foundation is to give back to the community that has been so good to us. And we are doing that primarily by associating with charities that we feel achieve that goal. St. Patrick's Center is, uh, is a charity that we've partnered with that uh, represents what we'd like to do. And uh, the donation of a vehicle to a needy family uh, gives them the uh, freedom to move about on their own schedule, whether it's going to work, whether it's going to school, whatever, you know, it, uh, it gives them a great ability to be mobilized. I really enjoy working for an organization that does charitable deeds, whether it be through our monthly charities or something like this where we're giving a vehicle to someone who truly deserves and needs it. Any vehicle, regardless of age, is going to have some blemishes on it, and so what we're doing to fix those is we're uh, sanding down and painting the bumpers. We're going to do the headlight restoration so they're clear and new looking, and uh, any other minor scrapes we're going to buff out and get set up. One of the great things about working on one of these vehicles for the Lita Foundation is knowing that it's going to go to a family in need, you know, a family who could really benefit from using this vehicle. We got the car all fixed up, it's been detailed, uh, it's ready to go to the family. We're very excited to see their faces when they get it. This is Courtney with the Frank Lita Automotive Group. We are down here at the St. Louis Union Station where the St. Patrick Center is having one of their meetings. One of their clients is inside and he thinks he's here to share his success story, but we're here to surprise him with a car. We're getting everything ready outside and in just a minute, we're gonna bring him out for the big reveal. As you can all imagine, working your way back from uh, poverty is very difficult and personal transportation in St. Louis is kind of a necessity. It's something that most of us take for granted. So what we've been doing is uh, working with St. Patrick Center to find clients who are especially uh, deserving of such a gift. And um, so at this time, I'd like to invite Fred up. Fred? Nice to meet you. Hi, brother Jim. Fred, Michael, nice to meet you. How are you doing? Very well, thanks. Nice to meet you. So, when we heard uh, Fred's story, we were very inspired. Um, and first of all, I would be remiss if I also didn't say thanks for your service to our country. Um, and so, so we've had a lot of our team members over the last couple months. I've uh, been working really hard on uh, renewing and. Uh, kind of refurbishing uh, Honda Odyssey that we'd like you to take home tonight. So happy. We can get to make the doctor's appointments now, and uh, this is a great thing. St. Patrick's Veterans Program is very good to me. Uh, anything I can do to help the situation, to help the program, I'm willing to do it. <laughs> 